time, 450 horsepower, Porsche Cayenne Turbo. Under the hood of the Cayenne Turbo, you're going to find Porsche's familiar 4.5 liter twin turbocharged V8 engine. Now, this vehicle does produce 450 horsepower in stock form. Very, very fast, routed to a six-speed automatic, which in turn is routed to all four wheels. It's an automatic four-wheel drive system, full-time, adjustable suspension, 20-inch wheels, red performance brakes. As much as this thing can do in utility, it can do just as much duty on the track. It's an ultra-high performance truck. Just want to take a walk around the Porsche Cayenne Turbo, uh, give you some ideas, at least as far as equipment and condition of the exterior. Uh, across the front, uh, really an overall gorgeous shape. Uh, the only real blemish I can note is it uh, looks like there's just a small contact spot where there's a little small uh, gap in between here and it kind of cracked the plate frame. But uh, other than that, you know, any vehicle that's been on the road for any amount of time is going to have stone chips. Uh, so there's a couple in the clear coat, I'm sure, you know, across the front, but nothing that the camera's going to be able to pick up. Uh, really focus on the reflection uh, within the paint all the way around the car because you'll really see everything really is in, in stunning condition overall. Uh, this turbo model in particular is fitted with uh, Porsche's. 20-inch uh, wheel from the factory. This is the largest wheel that they offered uh, on the 05 model. Uh, you, get to see, you can see the uh, Porsche on the center crest there. Uh, red Porsche calipers, that is indicative of the turbo model. Uh, these are Continental uh, Sport Contact tires. Uh, they're the 4x4 variety, which means they're a mud and snow variety. Uh, you've got 275, 40R20s, and you've probably got about uh, 60 to 70 percent of the tread left on these tires. They do track perfectly straight. They're very quiet on the road. But I just want to exemplify the condition all the way down to the exterior. Driver's side is absolutely gorgeous. The wheels are in great condition. Just want to take a peek inside the cargo area on the Cayenne Turbo. You do have the option of opening the glass hatch or you can open the tailgate altogether. Uh, inside ample room, this does have a height adjustable suspension, so this is on the loading setting. And you can see uh, the floor is very, very low uh, and comfortable to where I'm standing. Uh, we do have the Porsche factory floor mats, as well as the Porsche six disc factory CD changer right in here. You can see the cartridge pop out. Uh, behind me, we have the, what I call the dog gate, fixed in here, attached right to the ceiling, as well as the cargo cover. And below here, an untouched spare. You can see the compressor canister for the air suspension, as well as the factory build uh, sticker. Take a look at the condition across the rear of the car. You can see the parking sensors all the way across for the front and rear park assist, as well as the signature quad outlet exhaust that is indicative of the turbo model. You also see the proper Cayenne turbo badging. This does let the rest of the world know that you are driving a 450 horsepower sport utility. Just a couple of little small divots here just from loading stuff, but as far as the you know, black paint is concerned, it's very difficult to see in the camera. They are very, very minor. Let's come around to the passenger side. And once again, focus on the reflection in the metallic black paint. Along the rocker here, there's a little bit of a contact spot that could probably be airbrushed. I mean, there's really only surface uh, contact there, but uh, we could probably get that touched up where that would disappear. That's really the only major uh, blemish on the exterior, but wheels, tires, panels, paint, everything, all in original condition. Everything lines up perfectly. Really a hell of a car. Cayenne Turbo is constructed bank vault solid, just to give you an indication. You can slam these doors as hard as you want. Perfectly solid vehicle. And the passenger side as well. First uh, aesthetic feel of the interior of the Cayenne Turbo. You got an Alcantara roof and panels here. Uh, the A pillars are all decorated in Alcantara, as well as a leather dashboard. But look at the hand stitching along here. That's incredible. The detail's unbelievable. Fit and finish is amazing. All of the materials they use in here are top notch. Just top shelf stuff. Uh, everything feels great to the to the touch. Great steering layout. Uh, very supportive seat. You've got nice bolsters on the side, but I have done uh, you know a couple hundred miles in these, and they're very comfortable, especially for four adults. But uh, great steering wheel. Tiptronic shifters here for the Tiptronic shift override on the automatic. Uh, you've got Xenon headlamps uh, selectable over here. Your ignition, as should be on any proper Porsche, is on the left. Got uh, multi-function control here, power tilt and tele telescope steering wheel. You've got a liquid crystal display here. This is 
unique to the turbo model, but it's a really unique layout and it's very, very clear. A bunch of customizable information you could put in there. Going back to the top of the center console here, uh, heated seats for both front passengers. This switch here will operate the Porsche stability management. I uh, just clicked it off there and we'll click it back on, but that's your traction and stability control. Uh, in this cluster here, you have your stereo, CD player, satellite radio, and navigation controls, as well as a couple customization options for the car, but Bose sound system, you have a subwoofer in the rear, it's an unbelievable sound system, and there's a bunch of customizable options for it with the surround setting. It sounds incredible when it's just uh, you in the car all by yourself and you've got your favorite stuff on full blast. Uh, down here, automatic climate control, dual zones for the front passengers, as well as the shifter for the six-speed auto. Pop that into the left there, you're gonna go into the manual mode. You can use the Tiptronic shifters here, or you can uh, push forward or pull back to facilitate shifts right on the console. Just back of that, here's the adjustments for the suspension. You've got three ride control settings, comfort, normal, and sport. Comfort's very, very squishy, but still controlled. Normal just feels like a normal ride, and sport is a pretty aggressive, uh, pretty stiffly sprung ride, but in the sport mode, the car handles amazing. The lever next to that is your height adjustable suspension. If you want to select the load level setting, you can see it's blinking right now, but as, we're, as we go, we're going down right now. It's going to take us back to the load setting. And uh, it's great to have. It's really simple to get in and out of these cars. If you've got a dress on, if you've got to help somebody in and out that's not, uh, not as tall, uh, you, you gain a few inches of access there. Seating position in the Cayenne Turbo is very sporty as well. Great position. You can see across the entire hood here. But look at the quality of these seats. The leather, the bolsters, it's got perforations in the middle here. And when combined with the heat, they're some of the most comfortable cars out there. You've got these leather stitch handles that uh, have some of the... Uh, <laughs> people make their own nicknames up for these. I'm sure you can come up with one of your own, but very, very comfortable. Behind the wheel of the Cayenne, no question that this is a very, very sporty truck. Got to let off so I don't put in jail here just absolutely communicates as you'd expect of a Porsche uh, with an 18,000 mile version as well it, this probably drives exactly like the day it was brand new uh, built it's just overall incredible truck but you've got leather everything Alcantara suede roof great navigation system awesome Bose sound got my heated seats here got heated seats in the rear 20 inch wheels on the outside with great tires I've got my adjustable suspension it's height adjustable as well but uh, I'm on comfort now if I go to sport, you can immediately feel this thing firm up, but wow, does it launch. There's no reason a sport utility should go this fast, but the fact that it does makes it so unique. This Cayenne accelerates like brand new. Unreal. Look at the handle, it's so smooth. And the brakes come down, just excellent. Smoother than hell to ride, just get right back on it. Excellent V8 sound and ultra responsive. And it's like brand new. It's a great truck to drive. When you really truly think about what this truck stands for, you almost shouldn't be able to have as much fun in something that can carry five people comfortably and be as capable off-road and still just haul in a straight line. Uh, you can lap in this car on the track and for an 18,000 mile 05, you can't find these out there. We can replicate this car if we tried. Got some information here in my hand, uh, copy of the vehicle history report. Uh, it is a one owner car. It was a four year lease uh, through Porsche Financial. Uh, that's who we purchased the vehicle from. We did buy it directly from Porsche Financial. Uh, really a squeaky clean shows the car was registered uh, 11 24 and the last entry is when we just had the car titled in our name here. So really an overall, it, it's a steal. I mean you really can't find more performance and more luxury in combination uh, than you can with the Cayenne Turbo. It's an absolute blast to drive. It's one of my all time favorites let alone being a truck but you can't ring out too much more than anything else. Thanks for taking the time to check out this Cayenne Turbo. Pretty amazing. I don't think I have to do too much more to say than that, but uh, check us out online. You can see our full inventory at chicagocarsdirect.com, or you can see our entire film reel at youtube.com slash chicagocarsdirect. Thanks for taking the time again. We'll see you next time.